Okay, um, so, oh my goodness, sorry, I'm so, like, disheveled. Okay, um, so I did film, I, so I was going to post a video, um, about, like, a day in my life, um, kind of, like, do, like, an update, kind of, sort of, about work and such like that, um, and how well work is going and so on and so forth, um, but I decided to delete all that, um, just because, like, something recently has come up that's made me kind of sort of second guess, like, sharing certain things, like, personal things online here. I know I already have so much already on, um, and I'm honestly kind of tempted to, like, go back and maybe, like, private some videos and such. And I feel like every YouTuber kind of goes through the stage where they reach a point where they're like, mm, maybe I shouldn't like keep this video online. Maybe this video is a little more private than I'd like it to be. Um, so I've mentioned this before as well. Um, I already have like started to kind of censor certain things, um, within like the last couple of years that I post on YouTube. Um, my, leaders have made it clear that they are aware of my YouTube channel and some of them maybe even watch my YouTube channel um or like they're aware of my social media presence and such um which has made me again also like kind of filter certain things that I've posted um or second guess certain things that I've posted I've filmed and also deleted a lot of footage before um but something has recently come up that um my fellow cast have kind of brought up that I thought that I should address that I haven't really addressed recently um and that is visiting me at work um so in the past it hasn't been much of an issue um typically I'm in the parks I am busy but like typically it's been like a stop by say hi to me um let me know like you watch my videos I have even had like cps or like cast come up to me i got bit on my other leg oh my god sorry i had like two large bug bites on both of my legs anyway um i've had cps come up to me and they've been like you know i've watched your videos and i was getting ready for the program thank you so much you were like an inspiration or you inspired me to like do the program or like really like touching stories like that they've said that and then they've been like you know thank you okay, bye, have a magical day or whatever. Um, that is totally fine. Even so, that is totally fine. Visiting me at work is not an issue. Um, stopping by, say I get like, I'll be hosting or I'll be in between hosting a activity or whatever and someone will come by and be like, hi Danny, I watched your videos, just want to say hi. Short and sweet and to the point, that is totally 100% fine. No issues whatsoever. Um, guests or viewers you guys finding me at work and just not distracting me isn't the right word but like occupying my time how do I put, well let me put it this way when I'm at work I am at work my job is very much a time sensitive thing um there are certain activities we have to start and end um it is very much a teamwork effort um, I have to like at any moment's notice, like stop what I'm doing and go and help another, uh, fellow cast member, um, so on and so forth. Like there are moments where like I'm super busy and I don't have any extra time to talk to anyone else. I've even had friends come and visit me at work and it's like, you know what, not right now is not the right time. And they would like come by a little bit later or whatever. Um, like it happens. I've even had my in-laws come and visit me at work and even they understand it's even if it's just like a high you know, and they give me like a hug or whatever and like leave. Um, when I'm at work, I am working. I am at work. Even if you, yes, you are a guest. Yes, you are a paying guest. Yes, you are a guest staying at one of our resorts. Like whatever the situation may be, whether you're just like coming back from Magic Kingdom and you're stopping by the lodge or you had a reservation at Trails End and came stop by, say hi at the fort whatever the situation is visiting me at work is not an issue the issue is is when you assume that you can just like sit and talk um 
for however long a period of time um like honestly like stopping by and saying hi and then going about our merry ways is best like i'm trying to be like super sensitive about this because i don't want to stop you guys from saying hi to me at work i love it when i have viewers come and say hi to me at work it makes me feel a little special um it makes me feel like this cute little youtube channel i've created like actually means something it's great but like when it's something that potentially hinders our operation or is a distraction to me or my other cast member friends it's no longer okay um i don't know how else to put it um but yeah i i don't know it's i i i've had already had to have multiple like meetings with my leaders about this youtube channel which is fine um but having a one-on-one -on -one, like actual conversation with like my coordinators about people coming in and visiting me and it distracting the team then that's it becomes a bigger issue and i'll be honest right now i am like trying my very best i'm a trainer i just got a trainer position that's very important we have a lot of new people coming in in my role right now and so i've been training a lot of new people and that's like very very important i'm one of the few trainers even so so like my influence is even more important on top of that right now i'm trying to earn the respect and then the potential position to get promoted in my role which is something that i've been i've been like wanting to be trainer for years but wanting to be like a coordinator is like something that I've also wanted for years, but it's something that I never thought I could achieve. And now I, it's like, it's close and it's in my grasp. And so right now I'm trying to like be as professional as I can be and overcome certain insecurities at work and such. And having an extra distraction right now just isn't, I don't want to say it's not ideal because I, again, I don't want to distract or I don't want to say don't visit me at work. That's not what I'm saying. I just want to say like, if you happen to see me while I'm working, a simple, hey, hi, Danny. Love your YouTube channel. I subscribe to your channel. Love the videos. You know, thanks for the content, whatever. Short, sweet, and to the point, and then going on your merry way, please. It is not meet and greet with Danny time that is not the situation at all um that's all I just wanted to share that um I've never had to share that before but because again this is such a more intimate role that I am involved in and has such a smaller team it's a bigger deal um but yeah I just wanted to share that with you guys also just realized the cats have been chewing on this I bet you this is Ruben I choose on everything Anyway, um, thank you guys for watching my YouTube channel. It definitely means a lot. Um, yeah, it's not the way I'd rather, I'd like to bring up my YouTube channel to my fellow coworkers. Not that I'm hiding this channel from my fellow coworkers. It's just one of those things where it's like, <sighs> I've had a couple of awkward conversations with coworkers that I've not particularly enjoyed. And it's not their fault. It's not your fault. It's just, I think you understand. I'm rambling at this point. Um, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I do have a lot of fun park videos coming up. I'm actually planning on rope dropping Magic Kingdom tomorrow, which I'm beyond ecstatic about because I haven't been to Magic Kingdom in so long, let alone rope drop it. I'm pumped. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. If you're interested in my fitness stuff, um, I'm not going to be half marathon training per se for a couple of months. Um, but I have thoroughly enjoyed using the new cast fitness center, um, which has been like awesome. So check out my princess fit diary channel, um, for all like my fitness and run Disney stuff. If that's something you're interested in. Um, but yeah, hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you around. Bye-bye.